Yo, what's up guys? Chase the Bro here. Welcome back to another Dark Souls 3 Weapon Showcase. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Falchion. And I thought what better way to do it than to cosplay our boy Ouroboro. <laughs> as that was his most used weapon in the Soul series. And we even are going to be pairing it with Dark Moonblade. Uh, but before I do that, I'll talk about the build a little bit. So what I plan to do since uh, the high damage output is mostly centered off of Dark Moonblade. Is we put 60 Faith, gets the highest spell buff with Yorshka's Chime. And then it's really up to you if you want to go 40 strength or 40 dex. Honestly, they get very similar damage output. The dex version would get, I think, 8 more damage. Uh, but the strength version gets around, like, 15 or so physical defense. Maybe 11 or 15, I forget. I checked earlier, but it, it's more flat defense for absorption. And then 8 more AR if you go with the dexterity build. So I decided to go with the heavy one, as my absorption isn't the highest on this type of build. And the armor itself... The, the cosplay armor it only has 22 physical absorption, so it's not very tanky. Thought I'd boost that up a bit. Um, here's the rings. Prisoner's Ring of Favor, Life Ring, and we're going with the Lingering Dragon Crest Ring for Dark Moonblade. So the AR, when two-handed, 398, right? But when you add the Dark Moonblade with 60 faith, that's, that's when you see the real numbers. 633. I honestly used to use Dark Moonblade probably on every build the first year that I played this game. But then I got more into swapping around my weapons as I invaded. So if you take your weapon off, you lose the buff. So spell buffs really aren't worth it for the way that I play in invasions. But for the weapon showcase, <laughs> it'll be awesome. Uh, the Felchin is one of the slower curve swords. So it's not as fast as the Scimitar or the Pontiff Knight Curve Sword. But it's still fast nonetheless. Still gets its R1, R1 true combo. The running attack still comes out well. Uh, the R2 is where it's unique. If you land the charged R2, it actually combos into the weapon art. Not that it will probably land that, because people kind of have to walk into this for that to happen. <laughs> but I will try it. I'm going to try to be aggressive with the Dark Moonblade as well, since we only have it for like a minute and a half. But yeah, that's that's it. Let's just go into the arena and see how we do as Obobobo. <laughs> Alright, round one. And honestly, this terrain gives me nice cover for my buff. And my, my FP heal. Hello there, Amoria. Anuria. Hello. I only have so much time, I can't be gesturing at you. I'm sorry. I must murder you. It is the Ouroboro way. Wah. Wah. Dodge. I'm a deke artist. <laughs> Get in that corner. We've zoned the Havel nicely. Woo. Smack. Fun fight on Aria. Fun fight. In true R1 fashion. <laughs> Jumping into round two with what looks like a wizard. But it's not a wizard, actually. Hello there, and I realized I don't have to use my FP. Ooh, I can't tell if that was Lightning Blade or if it was, um, trades! R1s! Oh my god! What? <laughs> Wait, what did what did 700 damage? Did they like lag and take two hits at once? <laughs> what? All right, the last one was weird, but moving on. Hello there, sir. You uh, look like you have a dagger. Confirmed. <laughs> Is that the handmaid's dagger? What the? Oh wait, no, it's the poison dagger, huh? Oof, this thing does damage, man. I really forgot how powerful Dark Moonblade can be. I honestly used to put it on everything, my split leaf, my cell swords, any combo weapon, and it would almost one combo a phantom health. Ooh, this map's a little bit bigger. Maybe I'll buff like here. Be a little bit smarter with the timing. Hello, man. Add formant three. Oh, he's got the running attack of the katana. This could be difficult with the falchion. We'll see how we handle it. Oh. We might take off the life ring. Throw on the Lloyd shield. Yep. No, we need we need regen. We need regen. There we go. He seems like a running attack specialist, which is kind of rough because our connection doesn't afford spacing that that well. But our damage does. <laughs> Fun fight, Informant. You just gotta get in on the katana. 
The running attack spacing is kind of rough on it, but it can work. All right, there we go. All right, depending on what we're... Oh, I might try to land the heavy attack into the weapon art combo. We'll see if we can pull it off. He's got a straight sword. Hello, enemy. We'll see. Maybe I can hit him with one R1 quick. Make him panic a little bit. We hit him with the end of the weapon art, not the true combo, but... Ah, uh, it's so hard because the R2 just ch charges up for eons. <laughs> Fun fight, enemy. <laughs> it's rough. You'd have to, like, space an ultra and they'd have to, like, walk at you after. Can't think of a situation where I'm getting hit by that fully charged, but, you know. We will attempt. Oh, a blue dooby doo Oh my god, a lightning blade Corvian versus a lightning blade scimitar. Alright, Corvian, show me what you got, Limbo. I'm spacing that very carefully because I know what it can do. Both of our buffs are going to wear off, aren't they? Good trade for me. Good trade indeed. He's going to try the weapon art because I'm spacing him. That's what's going to come out next. There's the weapon art. Damn, I took a hit before that though. I didn't want to trade that. That I'll trade though. <laughs> woo, woo. Good, good. You know what? Good flurry of attacks. Keep his regen down a little bit. Fun fight, Limbo. Corvian's a great weapon, honestly. Very good spacing with it, too. He got a nice flurry of mix-ups with the R1, R1 weapon art earlier. It was good. It was good. Oh, and now purple. Seeing a medley of colors here. Yo, nice cosplay. <laughs> Yo, amazing. What? What are the chances of running into two cosplay people? In, well, not two. I'm a cosplay person. A 1v1 with Ouroboro. R2. Oh my god, this might be it. Oh, you couldn't have given me that. <laughs> you were already basically dead. <laughs> I was hoping, man. <laughs> Damn. There you go. You got a hidden. With your lightning shuttle, by the way. <laughs> R1's. <laughs> Blood fight, man. Lockrick did well. Did Lockrick have lightning shuttles? I forget. <laughs> Fun fight though. Okay. Hopefully they run through the middle. Cause I'm in a buff right here. Hey, that looks like the guy we fought earlier, doesn't it? No, BD Meerkat. You look so much like the guy with the katana, though. <laughs> All right, BD Meerkat. Weapon art. What happened to my first part of the weapon art? <laughs> it seems to have not worked. <laughs> Alright, we can't get nail chomped. I think it will kill us. What? What? <laughs> Where am I? It's going. <laughs> Is the falchion's range that bad? It must be, I guess. Like hitting his toe. Shuttle. Definitely did that as a bait, yes. Aww. Huh. Oh! I was trying to chip his regen. It really looked like he had more than one HP. What the heck? Fun fight though, man. <laughs> Alright, Nameless King. You shall be my final fight. I like he's a blend between the Nameless and uh, Dragon Slayer. Okay. I ain't got time to waste like that. I got time to waste on honor. Ah! Oh, <laughs> I really. That was almost it, man. That was it. But I failed. While well, you reload that, I smack you. Oh, he's not gonna reload it. Well. Bum. I've been really trying not to backstab this time because, you know, this build is R1s go. 
It's kind of the point of it. But, you know, sometimes you just can't help it. Smack. Smack. Oh, I thought that was timed well, but the range just isn't there, sadly. That's a bummer. <laughs> Maybe I could finally get the R2. <laughs> I did it. I didn't get to do the combo, but that actually times well with a, a perfect wake-up hit. Fun fight, man. Oh, and here we go. An invasion before Dragon Slayer armor. Sir Saliva. <laughs> Gross. Hello. Hello, Sir Saliva. Dark Moon Blade. Go brr. Hello, Sir Saliva. You have the Goddards and Flames. Flames of the Abyss. You have more range on the Goddards than I have on this, but... But I lack in range. I make up for in damage, Sir Saliva. I like your outfit, though. It's very cute. Panic roll. Yes. We got the, the heal panic roll. That's your Bluestis. That's not what you want. You don't want the Bluestis. The backswing from downtown. Running attack. Smack. Smack. Plunge. With a miss. A missed plunge. Dodges the fire with great speed. This guy's looking for a heal. Will he find it? Chase pressuring without getting too close to the straight sword. Goes for the running attack. Saliva dead. <laughs> Fun fight though, man. But Ouroboro did you in. Beefy Dark Moonblade damage. Um, armor doesn't really matter. I always just cosplaying Ouroboro. Um, the rings definitely set them up like this. I would say, if you want to be using Dark Moon Blade. And yeah, I will see you guys all on the next weapon showcase. I hope you had a good time. Goodbye. Goodbye.